Hey guys, in this lesson, I'm going to write a C program to input an integer from the keyboard and convert the number into a positive number if the user input is a negative value. In other words, if user inputs a negative number, we have to convert that into a positive number. For example, if user enters 5, we have to display 5. But if user enters negative 5, we have to display positive 5. Okay, if user inputs negative 2, we have to display 2. Okay, let's go ahead and create a new C file in our IDE. You can use your IDE here. I'm using Visual Studio Code. Now, let's go ahead and say the file name as negative.c. You can use what you prefer. Now, remember you have to use .c as the extension for C file. Here, we can say hash include angle bracket inside that stdio.h ending angle bracket now we have to create main function in main and we can create braces now inside braces we have to return zero okay firstly we have to say something please enter a input like that let's say printf please enter the number like that let's show now i will create a new line by adding backslash n this is backslash okay and n this will create a new line in the terminal okay now we have to end up with the semicolon right here i will go ahead and create a variable int let's say something like value then i will read input now using scanf function in the scanf function in the double quotation I have to use this percentage symbol and D then we can receive numbers from the keyboard okay we can receive floating points numbers okay to use or to return or to get uh, positive number input we have to use F here in this case we are only receiving numbers like uh, 1 2 3 4 5 otherwise minus 1 2 3 4 5 like that okay now comma here I will say after the comma ampersand symbol I am using this ampersand symbol to define where is the memory location of a particular variable that we are showing here here in this case we are using the value variable that we created earlier okay now we can end up with the semicolon now we have to identify whether user have entered a negative number in other words if user entered a negative number we can do our uh, program to convert that number into a positive number i can say if value is less than zero using this we can check whether number is negative the number is negative means number is less than zero okay now we have to use this symbol okay now I will add braces inside braces I will do my operation to calculate the positive number let's say int number is equals to value now we have to multiply this by minus 1 what we are doing is multiplying some negative number with minus will result a po positive number like this okay minus multiply by minus will receive a positive number like this that's the case will happen here okay now i will uh, here it should be value okay not values there are no variable called values okay then i will set value is equals to number now all right now i can say printf inside the uh, parentheses in the double quotation i can uh, display my value for that i can say i am going to display a number so that we have to put percentage symbol and then d in the comma we can uh, separate 
here we have to pass in the value we don't have to use ampersand okay because we are displaying a value here then end up with the semicolon all right that's our program now let's go ahead and run this in the terminal you have to say gcc and then the file name make sure you are in the path of the file that you have created is now file name is negative dot c and then we have to say hyphen o and then executable file name here in this case let's provide as negative okay executable file has been created here to run that we have to say dot forward slash remember always you have to use dot forward slash otherwise you might you will end up with the error let's say negative please enter the number i will say negative 5 we will return 5 here let's try negative 2 we have 2 here what if if we try number 16 here we will have 16 okay that's it and i'll see you in the next lecture thank you